May I but speak with you a moment? Uh, I'd like to introduce myself. I am Prince Fabius of Morn, and this is my brother, Thaddeus, and his squire, uh, young Courtney. Hello. We'd like to thank you for your help with that dread beast. I have no time for your maiden pleasantries. My quest continues to the north. As does ours. Well, um, I thought maybe for the sake of both our quests that we could travel together. At least until we reach civilization. Yes, civilization. We are good men. We're questing to save my... <laughs> Excuse my brother. He's not familiar with the customs of the road. Do not touch me. Why are you making me look bad? A warrior on the road never divulges the nature of his quest. One never knows if his aim may conflict with another's. Yes, I was just being nice. As we are on the same path, I suppose you boys may follow me to Mordistartan. From there I seek navigation and march alone. We thank you. And um, may we have your name? I'm Isabel, the last living member of the Harsh Bargaruda. Well, Isabel, my brother and myself will ensure that you run into no danger while you travel with us. With our huge muscles, we shall protect you. Who? Protect what? To be fair, everyone will protect each other equally, I'm certain. But we will protect her more because we are men. Boo! <laughs> what are you doing, brother? What right do you have scaring a man like that? Oh, what right have you to spy on a bathing woman from the shrubs? <laughs> I'm simply keeping an eye on her. She is not like one of our dim-witted chambermaids that let me take them from behind. This woman has me vexed. What exactly would it take for one to tame such an adventurous slut? Well, I imagine she'd want a man to be honorable, bold, brave, know his way around a blade. Oh, God, she's looking at us. Remain perfectly still. 